Hello wonderful people, welcome back again to Anointed Lady TV, the home of news and politics. And we drop news every day and we also react to every videos that comes our way. If it is your first time in this channel, you are highly welcome. Thank you so much for stopping by. And if you are returning subscribers, we appreciate you for your massive support. And we say may God richly bless you all for supporting this channel. And if you haven't subscribed, please kindly smash on the subscribe button. Put on the bell so you get to know anytime we drop a new video. I have a video to present to you this very moment and I will be watching that video with you. And after watching, let's drop our opinion constructively at the comment section. Like our videos and also share our videos if possible. Bye for now. You have a child that's 61 years old. In the next one week or five days, Nigeria will be 61 years old. 61 years! So many people celebrate. When you get to 60 years, they celebrate. I thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Now, Nigeria will be 61 years old. Nigeria is 61 years old. The only way we can say God will thank you is because there still appears the name called Nigeria. That's why we are thanking God. There still appears the name called Nigeria. But indeed, is there anything called Nigeria? Indeed, a country 61 years, old man 61 years, full of enmity, full of division, hatred. 61 years old, Nigeria is just talking about enmity, hatred, division. 61 years old. You hate the state because of an individual. 61 years old child. You discriminate against some people because of their religion, because of where they come from. 61 years old. That's my dear. And we are clapping hands, Nigeria, Nigeria, Nigeria. Since one year old, where is the legislature? Since one year old, where is the legislature? A legislature that cannot think. A legislature, anything they bring is right. A legislature that cannot say that Nigeria has gotten to the edge of conducting a free and fair election. A legislator that will close their eyes every time they bring money, borrow, you borrow. Legislator that will not, this money we are giving you to borrow, where is it? Where are you applying it? 61 years old. The giant of Africa. Giant. 61 years old, giant of Africa. The money we are saying borrow, where are you applying it? You have no Congress to ask questions. You have a Congress, anything goes, anything they can do. Nothing will happen. That's Nigeria, 61 years old. So indeed, what are we celebrating about 61 years old? 61 years old, where are the courts? The courts have intimidated. The judges have abandoned their responsibility out of fear. Of what will happen? Yes, intimidation. We are seeing this something that's wrong because if someone in the night, they abandon their responsibility. They say, oh, "Anything for this as one is their own. Let them do." Everybody has a responsibility. So ask yourself a question, have I done my own part? Have I, by the oath of office I took, have I done what I'm supposed to do? So it is not every 1st of October we have to have Juma service, church service, thanking God that we are alive. Fine. I'm not talking about we are alive. But are we really alive? 
in the sense of are we really alive? It's not everybody who breathes and says alive. It's not true. If that's the definition of life, then I don't think I don't think that's really correct. We may come here and dance and like somebody will be dancing here, but is dead. The security agencies. Are they doing their work? Have they not been intimidated to this? Nigeria. We are celebrating 61 years old. We cannot do the right thing. Other countries are talking about how their elections should be transparent. We are talking about how we will plot to rig an election in 2023. Simple thing. Transmit a result electronically to show the transparency. To show that really the person you are declaring won the election is public. 61 years old. 61 years old. A man who presided and signed a report went to the Congress and voted against the report he signed. 61 years old. Can, can I imagine you 61 years old? The set of the committee. You are the chairman of the committee. You signed the report to, of the report. You went to the house and said, I vote against the report I signed. 61 years old. Papa, how are you a father? What kind of father are you? I thought by now, we should be talking about how this country will be competing with other developed nations. I thought by now, but we are talking about ethnicity, where you come from. Leadership is no longer based on merit. Leadership is based you are from left, or you are from right, or you are from front, or you are from back. Even when you know this man has no capacity, but simply because it's from my area. 61 years old of a country. People have stagnated, uh, have stagnated in their career. No promotion because they come from some other places. Some of their first places are this and that. They are still there. Why? They come from a particular area. 61 years old. So you see, the problem of Nigeria is not only when we say leadership of the country. No. All of us. All of us. When the church, the church has failed to perform their role. It's not a question of coming to church every day. No. When I went to Lagos last week, and my last Archbishop and Bishop, let me thank you people for the honor award for giving me an award. <laughs> but that award is not for me not to talk before you people know. But I told you that day that the church has failed to perform their role. If you perform your role, you can stand firm. This one years. Happy birthday. But then um, this is one uh, year. Uh, if that's an achievement, achieve. And that's just one year. What is it? What have you done? What is your achievement in 61 uh, years? That's what you should ask yourself. God who has given you life for 61 years. What have you in 61 years to do? What is your contribution to mankind? That is only when. You can be happy to be 70 years uh, old. You cannot be happy as a father at the age of 61 years old. Your children would, won't go to school. Your children are involved in kidnapping. Your children are courtes. And then you are doing birthday. God, I thank you for my life for 61 years old. No, nothing. That 61 years old has no meaning. To the society. So what can we be proud of Nigeria? It's 
one years old Nigerian who cannot conduct free and fair election as a country. We cannot see people as the same. I'm the president of a country. I discriminate against other people. I don't like this ethnic group. Is that what you should celebrate? There's another day. Today is for the church. Who are in the church? First of October, most of you will not be there. So that's why I'm saying what I'm saying here. So if you hear I say that, they say, yes, I said it today. Do you understand me? So even you who are called as there, what are you going to celebrate Nigeria 61? For God, them by the choir. Yes, I agree. You say with all your good voices. So what? What has it resulted to? Well behavior. So my Lord and Bishop and Bishop, I thank you for the prayers you have offered for the state, for the country, and for the church. The church, the leaders of the church, we expected to show good uh, example so that things will not be so I will before I complete let me refer you to sing this song again SSS five seven seven we need help please uh, 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 my Lord Archbishop don't be angry not the the choir sing SS and S five seven seven the first and the last. The choir, please. This is the period that you learned this uh, God. We need God at this point in our life. There's no in your time. The country is gone. Insecurity everywhere. And so everybody must to say, God, we need you at this time to save this country. No more confidence in man. Leadership, mass leadership has failed this country. 